I'm Joe Wallace for GearWire.com, and with me today is John Tatulis from Sound Devices, and we're talking about the new three-channel portable audio mixer, the 302. Tell me a little bit about it. The 302 is a, is a product that's perfect for applications where you want high-performance audio when you're recording onto camera. So you may be out in the field, you might have a lavalier, you might have a boom, you may have uh, a number of audio sources, and you're going to be bringing those back to the camera. So the 302 is very popular for ENG-style news acquisition, this kind of application that you're doing right here, where the sound mixer or the camera operator may want to have more control over their sound. So you've got very informative metering, you've got a very flexible headphone monitoring section, and you have lots of control for the microphones, phantom powering, and you can send the microphone signal to multiple destinations. Now let me give you a scenario where a musician might want to use something like this in a live sound application. If someone is doing a documentary on their band or if they're trying to record a concert on uh, three cameras or uh, just some other way of capturing the event, uh, what kind of advice would you give for them about the 302? Well, the mixer is more or less the command and control center for your sound. So it's going to be the place where you're going to be able to make decisions on microphone placement, microphone choice. And in a production sound, it's, it's a little bit different than a music type of application where you want to get maximum speech intelligibility. So that's going to be your primary criteria. And with your mixer, with good in information it's giving you on levels and what you're getting back in your headphones, that's going to be how you're going to make good microphone selection choices. Would this be a good choice for a band that wants to get a video crew in there and uh, supply them with a little bit of gear? Well, it's going to be the choice. The video crew is going to be using this kind of piece, so it's not necessarily for the music production side of it. It will be more on the the picture side of it, right. the documentary side, or, or the uh, music video side, so to speak. If you're doing a live show, correct. Hey, great. I've been talking with John Tatolis from uh, Sound Devices. I'm Joe Wallace for GearWire.com.